Hey guys, so I'm here in Jerome, Arizona. A uh, little town up in the mountains. Uh, it's like, I want to say 7,000 feet up, I think. Uh, I might be wrong in that, but I think it's we're way up here. Anyways, uh, there's a very interesting, uh, uh, what is it, like a, it's a museum here. This guy has everything, old cars, old everything. He's got generators, motors, I mean, everything old. It's an old mining town. It's an old mining town, so, uh, you know, there's a lot of equipment. There's a lot of cool things to see. Amongst all that stuff, look at what we found here. There's a Studebaker, a, a 1902 Studebaker. It's an electric car. It runs on 48 volts. Uh, the motor runs at 1750 RPMs. And uh, it has, amazingly, regenerative braking. Um, it has a top speed of 13 miles per hour and it uses fuel weakening. I guess it uses a rheostat uh, that you turn the power down so the amps go up and the motors uh, RPMs go up and you would use that to pass people I guess you know if you needed to pass another vehicle or something. Um, it has a, it's a, it's runs on a 48 volt uh, system and it has a, a 40 mile range a 13 uh, miles per hour top speed I guess. Um, the crazy thing is, he told me, uh, the, the, you know, the owner, uh, he restored it, and he told me that this is uh, serial number three. So this car right here is the oldest Studebaker in the world. Um, not only that, but it's uh, an electric. He told me that Studebakers uh, made electric cars for about 10 years. And then they, uh, I guess by that time, the uh, gas, uh, internal combustion, you know, kind of won the, the war against, you know, between those two and so they started making uh, combustion engine vehicles so this is actually pretty cool um, it works he restored it uh, he doesn't know what the batteries originally what batteries it had in there so um, he just made a, a new box and put four uh, 12 volt batteries um, lead acid batteries and this thing runs uh, he says he takes it to shows all the time and he plans to take it to California. There's going to be a show that uh, does, uh, I guess they're going to be celebrating the beginning of Route 66. And I guess uh, Jay Leno is going to have, you know, all his steam car and his electric cars that he's got and stuff. He plans to take this over there. So uh, we're going to keep up with him and maybe we'll get to see this car out in California. We'll actually maybe get to see it running and stuff. But I wanted to share it with you guys. It's a pretty cool find uh, in the middle of Arizona. Uh, I'm here doing a BW show, so uh, it's I never expected to see this here. Um, so it's pretty cool. All right, guys.